Rapa Nui Airport. Look at how lovely you look with your lei on. Um, though it's not a lei here. Here we are, another 2,500 miles away from the South American coast. Oh. Way to spend Christmas Day, is it? It's better than being back in icy, cold, snowy Chicago. Here's our room at the Otai Hotel. From what I've read, it's usually frequented by small tour groups, not large tour groups. Buenos dias. Se puede sentar. Sí. La taza, los platos. Three dollars a bottle here. One and a half three. This one truly isn't that terrible, considering that everything has to be flown out to Eastern Island. Everything. Only supermarket in town, and I'll tell you, I think that's the business to be in. Our first meal on Easter Island, or Rapa Nui, at Krava Restaurant. Very nice, pleasant people. I feel like I'm back in Tahiti. Krava's daily specials for 5,000 Chilean pesos, which is $10 US. Smells good though. Every visitor has to buy an Easter Island Park admission fee, which is 65 US a person. But here are some moai right here at the beach. I don't know if you know much about Rapa Nui or Easter Island, and I certainly don't know a lot yet. Tomorrow we start tours, morning and afternoon tours, the next day a full day tour to see the moai, which I just showed you, in different locations, the quarry, etc. But if you've ever read James Mishner's Hawaii, which I read a bazillion years ago, it tells about how the Polynesians left one of their islands and navigated thousands of miles over open sea to find Hawaii and settle in the Hawaiian Islands. Well, it, it's the same thing here in Easter Island. Nobody knows exactly when the people came to Easter Island or exactly why they erected these gigantic, gigantic stone moais. But we're gonna find out tomorrow. In the meantime, I've been thinking about Easter Island for years and years and years, and some people say, well, why are you gonna spend all that kind of money to visit a place that's so inaccessible and very costly? There's nothing inexpensive about getting to Easter Island. I could say because it's there, but I also could say because the moai are beginning to crumble away, the features are becoming indistinct, and if you want to see them, one of the great sights of the world, then you pay the piper. So here we are, and come along with us. way to spend Christmas Day, isn't it? Don't you love the Christmas decorations on the street?
use whatever you've got. Petrol, everything has to be brought by ship, which comes in every two weeks or so from Valparaiso. Then they, then they tediously have to unload it all, bring it in, and either it's delivered or you pick up whatever you ordered. We were told that if you go into the post office, you have a choice of four different stamps that they will put into your passport that says Easter Island for free. Of course, it's closed today.